Conservatives in Washington are taking issue with the White House's pride celebration of the LGBTQ community, with one senator claiming the Biden administration violated U.S. flag laws. Paul Spaynow checks that claim for PolitiFact. Did the White House's Pride event violate U.S. flag code? That's what Senator Roger Marshall, Republican from Kansas, tweeted after the event earlier this month. He suggested it's against the rules for the Pride flag to be in the middle of two American flags. And he pointed to this section of the American Legion website, which says the flag should be at the center and highest point of a group of flags when they are displayed from staffs. Now that part's important. Those flags in his tweet weren't on staffs. They were sort of draped and hanging from a balcony. And as you can see from this photo, there was a U.S. flag hanging from a staff at a much higher position on the White House roof. It's also important to note these rules, they're not laws. They're just guidelines. And according to the Congressional Research Service, efforts to enforce them have been repeatedly shot down by the Supreme Court. And frankly, this isn't the first time we fact-checked a claim like this. Back in 2011, bloggers accused Republican Congressman Alan West of breaking the law when he went scuba diving with an American flag. That claim, we rated false, and this one, the truth meter says, is false as well. Read our full fact check at WRL.com.